If a positively charged metal ion is placed into water, water molecules surround the ion. Oxygen atoms in water molecules have a partial negative charge and get attracted to the positively charged metal ion, and a coordinate bond forms between the metal ion and the oxygen atom. The electrons forming the coordinate bond come from a lone pair of electrons on the oxygen atom. Only six water molecules can get close enough to a metal ion to form coordinate bonds with it, meaning an octahedral arrangement of water molecules forms around a central metal ion as it dissolves in water. This forms a large single species that is called a complex ion. Specifically, it's a metal hexa aqua ion complex. Hexa aqua because there are six water molecules in it. Hex for six and aqua for water. As water molecules are neutral and have no charge, any complex ion that gets formed with them will still have the same overall charge as the metal ion in the center of the complex ion. For example, if copper two plus ions are added to water, they will each be surrounded by six water molecules that form coordinate bonds to them creating hexa-aqua-copper-2 complex ions. The copper ions that formed the complex had a charge of 2+, plus, and the water molecules a charge of 0, as they are neutral. As a result, the overall charge of each complex ion formed is 2+. Plus. Technically, the 2+, plus charge is no longer considered to belong in just to the copper ion anymore. It's spread out throughout the whole complex ion. Because of this, we write hexa-aqua complex ions in square brackets, with the number of water molecules around the metal ion shown in curved brackets, with a subscript number telling us how many water molecules there are in each complex ion. The overall charge of the complex ion is then shown as a superscript number outside the square brackets. A Q is often shown as a state symbol after the formula to show the complex ion is dissolved in water. The charge or oxidation state of the metal ion is important. Iron can form ions with two different charges, 2 plus and 3 plus. If iron 2 forms a complex of water ligands, the complex ion would have an overall charge of 2 plus, FeH2O6, 2 plus. However, if iron 3 forms a complex of water ligands, the complex ion would have an overall charge of 3 plus, FeH2O6, 3 plus.